Dulce Nombre de Maria Cathedral Basilica is a Roman Catholic cathedral in Guam. It is the seat of the Archbishop of the Roman Catholic Archdiocese of Agaña. It is located on the site where the island's first Catholic church was constructed in 1669, under the guidance of Padre San Vitores. The prison building looms above the palm trees and is a familiar landmark in downtown Agaña. The basilica enshrines the image of Santa Marian Comelin, patroness of Guam. The precursor of the present-day basilica was a chapel, or capilla, constructed of rough logs and nipa thatch built within the perimeter of the Plaza de España. The church was the focal site around which the administrative buildings were built. Built under the direction of Padre Diego Luis de San Vitores, with the assistance of the Chamorros of Hagatnia, it was dedicated on February 2, 1669. Queen Maria Anna donated 300 pesos and Chief Quipua of Hagatnia contributed the land. In 1670 a more permanent structure was erected. Built of coral stones with the technique of Mamposteria, this structural foundation expanded to become the cathedral. Within this structure were walls, ceilings and floors constructed of Ifeal wood. A fresco on the rear wall depicted the Assumption of the Blessed Virgin Mary. The original cathedral was destroyed by bombardment during the 1944 Second Battle of Guam. According to historian Benigno Palomo, in 1669, one of the main missions of the Spanish soldiers and missionaries was to exalt the Catholic faith and that the people living in islands and land of this sort, you will land, ought to bring to the Christian religion, from the Bill of Partition issued by Pope Alexander VI. Other churches were built at Funa near Umatac, at Tipungan by Asan, at Retidian, at Taraguay, at Dededo and Arat. Initially, many of these churches were destroyed by the Chamorros in their effort to regain their independence. Others were destroyed by natural causes. Over the years, the Chamorros gradually accepted the faith of the Spanish as their own. Before the war, there were nine churches and 22 chapels throughout Guam. These chapels were little sanctuaries between villages where one could privately pray during the long journey to and from home. All were destroyed during World War II except San Dionisio at Umatac, San Jose at Inarajan and San Francisco at Yona. The Cathedral Basilica's existing structure has reached its golden age of 50 years after being constructed and dedicated on April 20, 1959. The Cathedral Basilica serves as local landmark and is home to a community of parishioners who regularly attend Sunday Masses, sacred liturgies and annual events. It is also a place where Guam's visitors embrace the island's rich Catholic history and identity. The National Museum of the Dulce Nombre de Maria is located above the Chapel of Street. Teresa Blizio. The museum features changing displays of inspirational art created by local artists. Thanks for watching.